Did you know you can clear the entire first map in the original Pikmin game without using a single blue Pikmin? There are three water-based obstacles in the Forest of Hope where normally, yeah, you would need them. But I'm going to show you how you can bypass all of these using just red and yellow Pikmin. Starting with this log, which you can reach by just almost drowning your red Pikmin. This basically just exploits the max range that a Pikmin can quote-unquote swim as you whistle at them to reset their drown timer. And then you have this box, which the game expects you to use blue Pikmin to come alongside of it and throw Pikmin up that way, but you can just throw any Pikmin on top of the box and use a C stick to navigate them into position. And lastly, there's this underwater wall, which you can destroy by just throwing yellow Pikmin with bomb rocks in just the right spot. Doing this gets you access to this ledge where you can throw the rest of your Pikmin up and fight the armored cannon beetle days earlier than you're supposed to. And if you're fast enough, it's even possible to collect every ship piece in a single day, which, you know, for real though, that is extremely difficult, but it's kind of fun to try.